What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time dropping in, Tommy Kentner here. I know we've been out for a few weeks. Uh, I've been down with the flu, it's still not 100% over it, but gotta get y'all guys a little update on the GTR project for Peter and Scott. Uh, we did get the motor in, ran into a couple issues with uh, missing stuff. So, um, so we had to order like the drains and all that and to plug the rear turbo because these are twin turbo from factory. And then, so it's just a process and we're waiting on a few things for that. But we do have to have the car to fabrication in two weeks. So we got to get a move on, get this thing back on the road for them. So we'll show you what we've done. Adrian to kind of go over it. So. One of the major things that we did is we, I tried putting most of the motor together on the stand as possible. So we got like the oil cooler assembly with all the, the plumbing for that. The knock sensor harnesses kind of set in there where it needs to be. A lot of the accessories put in where they need to be. And then before we got the, the engine kind of stabbed in here, you know, your coolant lines and your make sure all your brake lines and your AC lines are all routed where they need to be. So we're not trying to fight that scratching up the engine bay or doing all that um, mocking up the, the turbo manifold to make sure we have good clearance around everything so that when it goes to fab you know he has as little uh, headache with that as possible like Tommy said we got a we got a date for about two weeks from now um, to have the car dropped off um, to get all the intercooler piping and the uh, down pipe exhaust uh, fan shroud stuff like that all done yep um, next step um, I wanted to get the intake man well, I got to get the intake manifold on and uh, we ran into a little uh, issue with the plenum so our plasma man plenum you can see yeah we're about one runner off and we're about to hit the uh, yeah, so master or the clutch clutch booster on yep. these cars slash clutch master cylinder. So they make a shorter version of that that will have, this is the stock one, but we'll have to get that. So I'll be sending a, you over a quote on that stuff and then that allow us to go on in. Yep. And then we'll be able to put the <clears throat> throttle body on and get the intercooler piping all done and the plumbing for the radiator. I already got your coolant pressure sensor in the intake. Yep. Intake is all pretty much put together minus, I just don't have the fuel uh, injectors in it yep. just to not have them sitting in there. And then we had to make like a custom, this is your coolant hose yeah, for the bottom of that. Under, goes underneath there. But A in lines, super nice. But like we said, um, the car, the motor's in the in the car, just um, waiting on a few key parts. Yeah. And we've already ordered, uh, I, like I said, I spoke to him yesterday, and we, but we've ordered a pretty good bit of stuff um, just to get it going. And like I said, ho hopefully have the car back to him soon. Yeah. And the valve covers are getting redone. Yes. This is just a temporary thing just to keep the motor kind of sealed up for now. And I know we, we talked about doing it gold. Um, so this is kind of just mocked up to give you a view of it in the car with the color. So if you do want to change it, let us know. Do we have the cover for the flight? Yeah, it's in the back. Oh, okay. But um, it, I was actually thinking the red, uh, Peter and Scott, if um, like the R34 red, cherry red cover, I think would go really good but um you know just give me a call let me know um and then we'll go from there but i think it's gonna come it's coming together like i said oh and then you want to lift it up that way i can show them the pan <clears throat> but here's the high octane uh pan that he uh, fabbed on. So you have to like cut it and then weld it. Uh, but this adds three more quarts. Yeah, I, th I think that's what it is. Yeah. 
And then so, you can see here your, your trigger kit. Yep. Your crank trigger kit. We'll be putting the dampener on once once we get up the motor put together yeah. a little bit more because I have to torque that to 360 foot yeah, pounds so or something like that. Crazy. But yep. It's coming along. But guys, like I said, I just wanted to get Peter and Scott a quick update. Uh, we do have a lot in the works. Um, I got some, I got, we got the JB4 in for the WRX. So there'll be videos coming on that soon. Got some new stuff on for the Midnight Purple. And um, Roberto's car is back for all the good, all the good stuff. So we will be working on that soon. Uh, a lot of stuff and sorry like that still still in the, the weather might not be the the best video <laughs> but i'm trying to recoup from having the flu it, it was rough guys uh, but hit that subscribe button you know join us in the next episode and adrian take us out not my job <laughs> all right take it easy guys peace